guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a review on these Enlight products. I have four products here to review for you guys. So if you want to hear my thoughts on all these products, then keep on watching. Alright, so if you watched my CVS haul, you would have known that I picked all of these things up from CVS. And all of these products were on clearance, so I don't know if CVS is discontinuing them or if my CVS is just getting rid of the brand or I, or they're like rebranding themselves. I, I don't really know, but I did find them on mine on CVS, so I will make sure to leave links for all of the products down below if you're interested in trying anything. So first off, I'm just I have all the boxes, but I'm just going to show you like one box and then so you guys get the gist. But this is what the box looks like and I really really liked it because it's like very metallic like this is a metallic -y silver and like this is like a metallic -y orange and you can I have no idea if you'll be able to see and that tiny little print right there says that the this is the actual size of the product which it is which I actually really really like so that's all on the front and then it also just tells you like what the product does there, none of these products have paraben sulfates, and they're no animal testing. They have the cute little animal, the cruelty-free guy right here. I think this is so cute, little heart. And so that's what all these have. And they also have Opti Shield, and that is a proprietary antioxidant complex that helps against free radicals and environmental aggressors. So I'm assuming that it just helps. Um, like prevent like the grossness that's out in the world but all the boxes have this on the side which this was just, this was just what I was reading then back here is just pretty much the back of all the products which is just like how to use it and the um, ingredients and then this side right here is just always like what the benefits of the product are so first I'm going to talk about this and this is the Enlight Superface liquid assets detoxifying platinum peel off mask and this is 3.4 fluid ounces or 100 milliliters this has colloidal colloidal i have no idea platinum peptides and i don't know words i'll have all like what it includes like there but basically this is just a peel off mask and it comes out silver if you guys can see let's see yeah, it is silver. It's just a silver peel-off mask. I actually looked it up online when I started using it, and a lot of people were comparing it to the silver Glam Glow, Glam Glow mask, and this one is more, like, budget-friendly. It is more, ex on, like, the more expensive side. I think, the, yeah, the original price of this was $20.99. But obviously that's a way better price than Glam Glows. So I really, really like the packaging of this. This is just like a squeezy tube. But then this, I thought it was like a cap. But if you guys can see, there's like this hole right here. Basically you turn this and then you squeeze it up. I'm not going to squeeze it up because I don't want to make a mess. But if you squeeze it up, the product comes out of this hole. Which I thought was really, really nice that there was no cap. Another thing I really like about this is that the peel off, it doesn't hurt. It's a very nice, comfortable peel off mask this mask is really supposed to help with like anti-aging um this helps reduce the appearance of fine lines wrinkles and improve skin luminosity while it ships away dead skin cells and impurities to reveal immediate and visible results i've noticed that my skin is a little brighter which i really do like i don't really have fine lines yet because i'm only 23 <laughs> I just thought maybe if I start using like anti-aging products, it'll, you know, help prevent that in the future. The thing that I'm not a fan of is there are like little specks of silver sparkles in here and they get like everywhere and I'll find them on my face. So you should really wash your face off really, really good after using that. I like to peel it off and then like whatever else is still on my face, I will take a wash, like a warm washcloth kind of and just scrub it all away and just double check that there is no sparkles left over. All right, next up, I'm going to talk about the Heightened Awareness Anytime Beauty Refresher. This looks like it's a high-end <laughs> perfume, but it's really just, let's see, I feel like it says it was like a toner, but I really, really like this. I'll spray it on my face in the morning because it says that it's good for like energizing and your skin and stuff and I just feel like in the morning that's just when I need that the most. This has 
coconut water, peppermint oil, and cucumber extract in it. And oh my god, it smells so good. This really just gives you just like a little pick-me-up in the morning. I don't know, the smell too is just very relaxing. This does not have one of those like, what does Luster Lux call? A camel spit spray. It has like a nice mist. I'll show you guys. I don't really think it's like do anything to my makeup. But just sprays like that. I'm excited to use this because it is almost summer here whenever New Jersey decides to warm up. And this is going to be perfect for summer mornings when I'm like sweating in the morning when I wake up. Next up is this Wake Up Eyes Cooling Eye Invigorator. That is supposed to help remove dark circles and make your eyes less puffy when you wake up in the morning. And oh my gosh, I honestly feel like my dark circles have gone down a lot. Puffiness, I never really had puffiness. That wasn't really an issue for me. But dry, but dry circles, but dark circles was an issue. And I really think that this is helping it. This has caffeine, cucumber extract, and coconut water in it. And I really love how this is. This has the three little like balls and you just rub it right here. And it just feels so nice. I put this on, this I use this when I wake up and then I use this. So this goes on first and then I do that and then I'll put on my moisturizer after I'm done getting dressed because this says that you should leave it on for a minute before you put on moisturizer or makeup. I haven't put on makeup just because I don't put my makeup on right when I wake up in the morning. But I've really been liking this. It's just like a nice, cool feeling. And last but not least is this Secret Service Lip Nourishing Cream. Now, if you watched my CVS haul, you would have known that I found out last second that there was sweet almond oil in this. And I was really, really afraid to try it out. But, but I'm still here, so it didn't... I didn't have like any reactions to it when I did use it. One thing I did not like about this is that it takes a really, really long time to pump when you first get it. When I first opened it, I thought it was empty because I was pumping it for a really, really long time, like almost 10 minutes. But that was just like one thing I didn't really like. This isn't very thick. It's kind of like a lip gloss consistency, I would say. It's very comfortable on the lips. I haven't really noticed if this made my lips less chapped. I feel like I have permanent chapped lips. So maybe if I do like an empties or something, I will let you guys know if this did really help my chapped lips or not. And that is it for today's video. If you liked it, please give it a big thumbs up. And if you have not already, hit that red button down below to subscribe to my channel. Follow me on all my social media. That's always linked down below in the description box. You should follow me on Twitter because I'm super active there. If you guys have any video suggestions, let me know in the comments down below and I will try to get those out for you. Or if you just want to leave a comment and saying, hey, please do that too. I just love getting your comments. And that is all I have to say. So I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.